we've had a shooting here at Edgemont Towers where at least four people have been shot. There are fatalities. Uh, the shooter has left in a S10 pickup. We believe he's a white male with a very short haircut, possibly in his third. Investigators are on the scene trying to determine exactly what they are dealing with, but we believe the shooter did leave shortly after the shootings. There was uh, one person that we know of that has been transported uh, by the life-saving crew to the Bristol Regional Medical Center this time. Yes, we have identified the shooter. It's a Rusty L. Rumley, and his vehicle was uh, tracked down to the Carter County, Sullivan County line, and the vehicle has since wrecked Rasnick Hollow Road in Carter County. Uh, the Tennessee Highway Patrol and the Sullivan County Sheriff's Office, and by this time probably the Carter County Sheriff's Office, will probably be assisting and trying to find to make sure if he's in the vehicle are in the area. They have not approached the vehicle at this time. The shootings took place inside and outside of the building. Is talk a little bit about that. We we believe the incident started inside the building, and uh, we believe the suspect knew everyone uh, to some extent, and maybe there may have been one person that didn't know the suspect involved in this. Uh, but the situation continued until he exited the building. Uh, we're looking into the relationship of the victims, but they definitely, there is some contact with most of the victims and shooting some type of, uh, of uh, either new or uh, involved.